Deterministic Ethernet sounds like a paradox, right? Best effort Ethernet communication is very unpredictable and is deterministic only in very special cases. Therefore, the idea of deterministic Ethernet may sound contradictory. The term determinism can vary in meaning. For example, it can mean maximum end-to-end -end latency only, or it can mean controlled latency jitter and message order. Depending on how we define determinism, we can see it as a spectrum, from indeterministic to more deterministic to strictly deterministic. Over the last 35 years, Ethernet has been a best effort technology, but different efforts have been made to make it more deterministic. This makes it possible to use Ethernet in different critical applications. By adding strict determinism to Ethernet on the right side of the determinism spectrum seen on the slide, we are able to significantly enhance capability to host different applications in shared and converged Ethernet networks. For example, a circuit switching network is one that establishes a circuit or channel between nodes as if the nodes were physically connected with an electrical circuit. Circuit switching networks have strictly deterministic behavior, jitter, and latency. In telecommunications, creating a fixed line over Ethernet is called a pseudo-wire or TDM over Ethernet, but available implementations have very limited applicability in enterprise computing or edge networks. The definition of determinism depends on the needs of the application, but if unified and converged Ethernet networking is required, strict determinism can add additional capabilities for hosting different applications in a shared network. If we are able to cover the full spectrum of determinism from best effort to priority based to strictly deterministic communication over Ethernet, this would allow design of complex Ethernet networks that can run audio, video, control systems, storage, high performance distributed computing, and standard LAN applications in large multi-hop networks. Ethernet services are based on asynchronous communication and statistical multiplexing, and this is the major limiting factor for covering the full spectrum of deterministic communication. Therefore, circuit switching cannot be efficiently emulated using statistical multiplexing. This presentation is about adding a time-triggered service to Ethernet and making it strictly deterministic while allowing other priority-based traffic all the remaining bandwidth, resulting in truly deterministic Ethernet. Deterministic Ethernet has the potential to advance many applications, from enterprise and cloud computing to net-centric systems and the Internet in general. Strict determinism delivered by time-triggered services emulates circuit switching on top of asynchronous Ethernet and allows parallel operation of synchronous and asynchronous communication in one network. Time-triggered services run on top of switched IEEE 802.3 Ethernet at Layer 2. They provide fault-tolerant distributed time synchronization and enable full control of jitter and latency for time-triggered data streams in multi-hop networks, even in the case of heavy system workload and multiple faults. By providing a TDM partitioning of Ethernet bandwidth, circuit switching can be emulated over an asynchronous Ethernet network. Time-triggered services are free from limitations of statistical multiplexing and can therefore resolve congestion management challenges without any high-level services or traffic class prioritization mechanisms. Synchronous and asynchronous communication operate in parallel over the Ethernet network. The unused time-triggered bandwidth is automatically released for asynchronous traffic. This simplifies bandwidth use and enables seamless operation with other low-latency IEEE 802 services. Time-triggered services are implemented in TT Ethernet switches provided by TT Tech. We summarize TT Ethernet capabilities in this chart as follows. Based on fault-tolerant distributed time synchronization algorithms utilizing asynchronous packet-switched communication, we can achieve accurate synchronization throughout the system, as well as microsecond jitter and defined latency. This adds the capability to provide robust TDM-style bandwidth partitioning capability and enables design of pseudo-wires and emulation of circuit-switched communication over Ethernet. Circuit-switched communication allows deterministic isochronous communication with microsecond jitter and hard real-time behavior. Circuit switching enables something we call hard real-time converged Ethernet, the combination of hard real-time lossless, stateless, and low-latency data streams, which can work with standard LAN applications in one network. 
This means critical and best effort traffic can efficiently share the network bandwidth. Finally, time-triggered services enable design of fail operational and high availability systems. Time-triggered services support fault detection, isolation, and recovery in hard real time. All of these capabilities help Ethernet to cover the full spectrum of determinism and cover different critical applications in unified or converged networks. Key TT Ethernet mechanisms are being standardized by SAE as an open standard, SAE AS6802, and the standard release is expected at the end of 2011.